Welcome to another edition of IMO Sports with Pedro Justice. Breaking news. <laughs> Breaking news in the Deontay Wilder versus Anthony Joshua talks. It seems as though Eddie Hearn has acknowledged the fact that he has been in touch with the Wilder camp. Now, of course, he had to take a dig and say that he had to initiate the conversation because the contacts on the Wilder side has been lost or misplaced or incorrect, which I find to be laughable because just last week he said he contacted Al Heyman. So what is he talking about? But never mind that. What we want to focus on is the fact that at least this is something positive that we're moving in the right direction. Hopefully, because as we know, Eddie Hearn is slick and he lies all the time. If you didn't know that, sorry to burst your bubble. Eddie Hearn said, and I quote, I spoke to Steven Espinoza to talk about mapping it out. And he said a Joshua Wilder fight works best for him in September or December. And for those who don't know, Steven Espinoza is the executive vice president and general manager of Showtime Sports. So a fight of that magnitude to be put on by Showtime pay-per-view, it would have to be between September and December because those are the months where you put on mega fights when it has two colossal titans as such as Anthony Joshua and Deontay Wilder. Now, Eddie Hearn said that he needs to talk with Anthony Joshua on Thursday to discuss coming up with an offer and also whether or not they want to take a fight before the potential fight with Deontay Wilder. Now, if Anthony Joshua fights in the summer, I'm pretty sure that Deontay Wilder would fight in the summer. And Eddie Hearn also said that before Anthony Joshua's next fight is signed, he will have to have a deal in place with Deontay Wilder to fight in possibly December, more than likely. So to me, this is good news. I'm not holding my breath because Eddie Hearn is a slickster, but at least he's acknowledged that they have been communicating and all we can do is wait and see what happens. Are you excited? Let me know. If you think this is just uh, posturing, let me know. Until next time, it's Pedro Justice.